Even a small cylinder misfire will impact the Phytech EFI systems. Today on Phytech's Tech Tuesday, we're going to show you how to identify a cylinder misfire and simple ways to correct them. So in the handheld, when we have the engine running, we're going to watch our air fuel ratio versus our target. But then we're also going to take into account our AFR learn and trim percentage. Since we have a cylinder misfire on this engine, what you're going to notice is that the air fuel ratio is going to keep jumping really high and the computer is going to keep trimming in more and more fuel in. And as it's running, the air fuel ratio is going to keep going lean and then correcting, lean and then correcting. And what's happening there is the oxygen sensor is reading the oxygen from that cylinder misfire and telling the computer that the engine's running lean so the computer adds more fuel. So regardless of if more fuel is added since the cylinder is misfiring, that oxygen getting to the oxygen sensor is never going to disappear so the computer is always going to be chasing itself, trying to correct the air fuel ratio. Until we correct that cylinder misfire, the system's not going to stabilize. So we're going to show you how it runs when it's completely unstable and has the cylinder misfire. And then again, when we correct that cylinder misfire, how it runs. So as you can see, the air fuel ratio kind of gets close to the 14 and a half target and then shoots up to around 15 to one. Also, we're billowing some black smoke now because the engine isn't actually running that air fuel ratio. It's actually running much richer. There we saw it jumped up to 15.3. Another way you can verify you are experiencing a cylinder misfire after reading your AFRs is checking for a cold cylinder. As you can see here, the temp gun is reading upwards of 300 degrees, but on the other side, it is only reading a bit over 100 degrees. The cause of the misfire in our case was disconnected plug wires, so all we have to do is connect them properly and the engine will run as it should. So now that we got our cylinder misfires fixed, we're gonna start up the engine again. We'll watch our air fuel ratio. It's gonna be a lot more stable than it was before, but also keep an eye on the AFR trim and learn percentage, which are gonna be pulling a lot more fuel out. The engine was running so rich before because it was reading the oxygen from the misfire. Now that we're firing on all cylinders, our air fuel ratio will be correct. The engine will be initially running rich and it will start pulling a bunch of fuel out of these values. So there you have it. Today we showed you a basic cylinder misfire off of an arcing plug wire. Arcing plug wires or a burnt plug wire are among the most common reasons for a cylinder misfire with a Phytech EFI system. Those misfires read lean on the oxygen sensor and the computer has to chase itself to add fuel. And that's what nets in the issues that you run into with extreme rich condition and any other type of issue with the computer chasing the air fuel ratio. Once we corrected those misfires, the engine started running clean again, the AFR trim percentages came back, and they stabilized. As you know, a cylinder misfire can happen for more than one reason than a burnt plug wire or arcing plug wire. That's just our most common. So be aware that there's other reasons why a cylinder misfire may happen that you may need to dig into. I hope that answers any questions you had regarding this topic today. If you have any additional questions, please comment them down below and visit our website at phytechefi.com for additional tech videos.